Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So something we have previously spoken about on the channel, if your Windows 10 PC cannot be upgraded to Windows 11 after the end of support that's fast approaching next month on the 14th of October, is that Microsoft has suggested that you recycle or trade in your Windows 10 PC, which obviously has caused a bit of debate and wants you to go out and buy a new Windows 11 device. Now, just to let you know, in regards to recycling your old PC, if we head into our settings, head to our Windows Update page, it seems that Microsoft has quietly added a new Learn About Options to Trade In or Recycle Your PC. There's a toggle here to the right on the Windows Update page that seems to be added recently. Now, if you click on the link, it'll open up the Microsoft Store online trade-in program where you can either trade in your Windows 10 PC for a specific value or recycle for good, which is an option when the trade-in request is not approved according to the website. Now, if I click on it in my region, I get this because it seems at this stage that this only seems to be working now for users in the United States because Microsoft has partnered with Texas-based Tel Advance for trading in and recycling Windows PCs. So if you're not based in the United States, there might be something else that Microsoft is going to do in the future regarding and finding a partner in your location. But what I did do is I just swapped my ZA location and entered US for the United States, something you can do with your regional abbreviation. And when I put in US, I got access to the Microsoft Store online trading program. Trade in your used laptop, tablet, phone, or game console and get cash back. And Microsoft says, the Microsoft Store trading program is powered by Tel Advance, as mentioned, a company that specializes in electronics, reuse and recycling. You can get cash back and your used device gets a new home or it's recycled in a responsible way. And then we've got a couple of options here. Get a trade-in value where you can check the eligibility of your used device and get a trade-in value on the Tel Advance trading page. You can send in your used device where Create a Tel Advance account, print a prepaid shipping label, and pack and ship your device to Tel Advance within 15 days of your trading approval. If it doesn't meet trading criteria, Tel Advance will recycle it or return it to you for free and get paid. Once everything is finalized by Tel Advance, you'll receive payment via PayPal or bank transfer within 14 days. And just on a quick side note, Microsoft is really going out of its way here to advertise new devices just on a quick side note obviously trying to lure windows 10 users as mentioned to purchase a new windows 11 pc now for personal and for business when it comes to the different descriptions all seems to be the same at this stage so there's no big difference there and if you get a trade in value you click on that and You've got the category, you've got your device type, so as an example, laptop. And then you get the brand, and obviously the model, and a praise, and then a checkout, and it'll go through the process as described on this section here. So just making you guys aware of this, that um, it seems that Microsoft was very serious about you recycling your PC. And just wanted to put it out there um, if you would be interested. And something else Microsoft says, because if you are like me and you are seeing this page where the link won't open because you're not in that region, Microsoft says that you should locate a, and I'm quoting, recycling service in your region to help divert electronic waste from landfills. As we have been speaking about, there was expected to be a lot of e-waste when a lot of these computers become and support it shortly. So that toggle is now available. 
learn about options to trade in or recycle your PC. So interesting stuff. Let me know your thoughts down below. Is this something you would ever use? Will you be recycling your perfectly working Windows 10 laptop just so you can rush out and go buy a Windows 11 PC as Microsoft is suggesting? Let me know your thoughts down below. Very interesting and I'm sure this could cause a bit of debate. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.